when it's a long stage or a long classic, it means that you sort of have to just build up and just eat as much as you can and, and uh, preferably carbohydrates. In that uh, case, I usually eat pasta, rice, uh, that sort of stuff. On the, on the day of the race, we make the final plan together. But the preparation of the race uh, starts uh, the day before already. I prefer to have massages uh, really before races and after races. It could be painful, but yeah, most of the time it's really nice, it's really relaxing. It also gives you the opportunity to just clear the mind and uh, take a few breaths and, and just relax and, and think about the next day. I think uh, a lot of people think it's, uh, it's a mystery what happens in the, inside the bus, but actually it's just like you and me sitting in a, in a normal uh, regular car. Actually everybody uh, comes together there, there's a preparation for the race there together. Yeah, it's like, uh, like a place where you relax a little bit just before uh, it all gets happening. We do a meeting uh, most of the time very open. So I also prefer that, uh, that riders are saying uh, what, uh, what they want and how they see it in the race. Because then uh, the motivation is coming really from themselves and not only from me. We discuss our plans and those plans, uh, that's what we stick to. Uh, you know the, the, the route, the race, uh, the, the corners, the hills and uh, it's all focus. When I get over the finish line, I feel, yeah, satisfaction for sure. But um, yeah, sometimes a big pleasure when we won or when we really achieved something. Uh, and sometimes it's, yeah, like, ah, oh, fuck, this could have been better. Or, uh, yeah, like small things, but what, what, what crossing your mind. Mm -hmm.